for the Utah Lake Festival, which is happening this Saturday, also in conjunction with that. It's free fishing day throughout the state. You have to follow all the rules, but you don't need a fishing license. So grab the family, grab your pole, and uh, go catch some fish. But if you come out here to Utah Lake, you might see this a lot, and that's just people in the paddle boats enjoying the water, the calm serenity of the lake here at Utah Lake. But one thing you might notice that's new out here is these bad boys right here. And uh, this is uh, Utah Lake on Adrenaline, and I've got Derek here. And Derek, you work out of the Utah Lake Marina, but what are you and who are you with? We're with uh, KiteUKB.com. We're a kiteboarding company. We do lessons, instruction, everything to do with kiteboarding. All right, right now, the shop. you were telling me yesterday uh, kids were getting about how much air? You get about 40 feet vertical, anywhere from 10 to 40 feet once you've had a little training, hmm. and about 100, 100 feet uh, horizontal. All right, now, we were going to show you some kiteboarding this morning, but you kind of need the wind, and we don't have wind. But we do have YouTube, and this is some kiteboarding at Lincoln Beach. And this this is really a craze. Yeah, it's it's pretty cool. It's a lot of intensity, and it's lo getting a, gaining a lot of popularity. Now, uh, how hard is it to pick up? It takes the average beginner between six and eight hours of instruction before they can get up and ride on the board. And uh, they come out here, and uh, you do lessons, I take it. We do. Yeah, we teach lessons right on the outer marina here. And and the packages start at five hundred bucks for ground school and water or snow. And uh, you provide the board and the kite. We provide everything: helmet, harness, everything. And uh, you say within about eight hours you can figure this out. Now, how is Utah Lake for the kiteboarding? Awesome. Great. We had excellent wind yesterday. We were about 25 mile an hour winds. Just gorgeous day. So now this just looks like a normal wakeboard. It looks like a wakeboard, but a little different. On the bottom, it's completely flat. There's no channeling. There's quite a bit of rocker to it. Okay. And the rocker provides what? Rocker provides ability to get on the edge and get on a nice flat surface to, to jump. All right, now let's go back here to the kite. The, the kite looks pretty big. How big of kite is it? This is a 13 meter, 13 square meter. So it's, its surface area is 13 meters. All right, and then that allows you to get, once again, how high? About anywhere from 10 to 40 feet based on the wind and the conditions of the rider. How right. good they are. All right, now do you mind if I just lift it up? No problem. All right, right hold ahead. it real quick. Got it. So just right here? Go, go from the center. Uh, yeah, there you go. Or like that. <laughs> or, or like that. Or about it. Mm -hmm. And then just run? That just run. That's I've it. I've got a bad hip, so that, that looks really right. funny. We'll, we'll send out paramedics if necessary. <laughs> <laughs> Count me down. Okay, I'm three, standby. two, one. Go, Casey! Yay! Ow. You're galloping. <laughs> you, didn't get, you didn't get much air. You didn't get much air, Casey. What's up? <laughs> One hit. One hit. Yeah. Makes it kind of tough. All right, go to kiteukb.com or call us at 687, that's air code 801, 687 Thanks. All right. Okay. Wow. Thank you. Is Casey okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, let's head on to Ron now. He's getting some tips for Father.